you'll see in this machine that we've now got a low drive sprocket instead of the high drive uh, we're normally associated with a Caterpillar tra type tractor. Now, the, the big advantage on this particular dozer is the fact that you can actually lower the, uh, the sprocket down giving you a lower centre of gravity and also the drive train inside so your, your, your drive motors, electric drive motors and your final drives are again lower down. And, and, and this gives a better balance to this particular machine without us having to put on heavy counterweights onto the back. So even without a ripper or extra counterweights it's a very very well balanced machine. Now you're putting the sprocket back down in the impact zone so to, 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 to help that situation they've designed a brand new um, lower undercarriage so the track frame itself has got big heavy castings at the back and a big heavy casting at the front here to, again to take that shock load also this machine doesn't have a, what you call a recoil spring in it so the spring inside the actual track frame itself it recoils to uh, take any shock load out of it what it actually does have is a nitrogen charged cylinder in there that nitrogen charge cylinders got a longer stroke and able to react quicker to take that shock loading away from the, the drive train and the sprocket and, and keep it within the actual track frame itself. Also, to help the, the lower and owner operating cost to this machine, the equaliser bar, it balances the two uh, track frames uh, together, um, would normally be uh, greased. Uh, this would mean that an uh, operator would have to crawl under the machine and grease that. And this new D7E, that's all done away with. This is now an oil-filled um, bearings, so they need to be uh, checked and maintained every 500 hours, as and when you would do the engine. So that's done by a finning engineer, again, taking that responsibility and uh, away from the operator, thus getting a longer life out of your components.